Are you pumped? Are you pumped? <laughs> yeah. It's time to get pumped, baby. Oh, yeah. Martial arts action, son. That's what we represent here on the channel, baby. And in the movie dojo today, you know, I had to rock with that movie dojo intro today because of who we have here on the channel. We have Dan Davy Thomas. Welcome, brother. Hi there. Thanks for having us. <laughs> yes. And Colin Squire here. Welcome, my friend. Thank you. Yes, and hey, my brother from another mother, Mark Strange, the legend, hey, has on. returned. Mark, it's been years since we've seen each <laughs> other, right? Has, ten, ten yeah. years. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, always the scene stealing, uh, Mark Strange. That's right. That's my nickname for you now, man. Everything you're in, you steal the scene. You just steal it. Thank you, brother. Uh, always yes, do my best. Especially Yes, yes, but it's awesome. We had a blast. Uh, if you guys have missed it, we had a blast last week uh, with the Rupture panel. Make sure you guys check out Rupture. It's free to watch on Tubi, but we had the casting director there with Mark, and we had a blast talking Rupture. But today, we're talking motherfucking combat zone, son. That's right. We're going to get into that zone. We're getting in the zone of combat today, baby. That's right. But first, before we play the actual short film that premiered, man, I mean, you guys, how awesome to get the love from Urban Action Experience and uh, was it Fighting Spirit Film Fighting Festival, Spirit, right, yeah. Colin? Yeah. yeah. I mean, that is that is awesome, man. Awesome. I mean, how cool is that yeah. for sure? Oh, I hear a pop. I hear a pop, and it's not my back. Here he is. Ryan just popped into the stream right here. Let me let him in here. <laughs> Hey, man, it's good to see you all. <laughs> hey! All right. Ryan, welcome, brother. Welcome to the channel, my friend. Finally. Thank you. Yes, yes. Great to see you, my friend. I'm glad you were able to make it. Definitely. Thanks a lot for inviting me. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We have here in the chat here. We have some badasses saying hello. What's <laughs> going on? KL's Entertainment Reviews there saying hello to everyone. There you go. Hi. Hello, Fat Samurai. Hi. Hi. An esteemed guest, and uh, Kevin says, Mark Strange is a legitimate <laughs> badass. That's right. That's right. Oh, we have another <laughs> martial artist and stuntman badass here watching us right now. Javon Wallace, what's going on, brother? Good to see you here watching. That's right. Keep kicking, keep kicking, my friend. Keep kicking. All right, but yeah, that's so awesome, man. Urban Action Experience and and uh, Fighting Spirit Film Festival for sure. That is awesome. And, I, and speaking of urban action experience, I actually had a chance to interview D Demetrius Angelo here on the channel, and that guy is just a great guy here. Oh, oh, oh what? We got Winnie. The, we got Winnie the Pooh up in here. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> What's up, Craig? Good to see you, brother. Still looking for that Winnie the Pooh movie. That's right. Keep an eye out for that because we represent horror here on the channel as well. So it's good to see everybody here, man. Let's go ahead and jump right into it here. Let me go ahead and uh, bring here the side here. All right. So let's just go ahead and go jumping right into it. So, yeah. Dan, why, why are you torturing me, Dan? Why are you torturing me, man, with all these, uh, yes. all these pictures with legends? <laughs> yeah. where, where was this, my friend? Uh, that one was in Scotland, 2019. Scotland Comic Con. 
Wow. And now, yeah. and now yeah. you're putting salt on samurai guys. You're putting salt uh, on yeah. samurai guys' wound now. Yeah. Now, now you got Manchester. Van Damme and Joel Ludren. Yeah, Universal Soldier amazing. Reunion. Amazing. Lucky. I was lucky That's to be there amazing. for that. Amazing. Yeah, yeah, that's amazing. So let's talk a little bit. So for those that you know, brand new that are watching right now, let's talk a little bit about your martial arts background, my friend. Yeah, absolutely. So I um I started martial arts. The floor is um, yours. Quite, quite a young age. So I mean, I started. I was watching Van Damme films from a really young age. I used to go around my nan's when I was about seven years old, and she'd uh, she'd have the uh, VHS uh, recorded off the TV, things like that. Some of the Van Damme films I used to watch, and I just loved it. So from a really young age, I just started watching Van Damme, uh, Bruce Lee, and I just wanted to get into it. I mean, Van Damme was the one for me. He was the man. I just saw him, and I just wanted to be him. So I started karate. Uh, I must have been about thirteen, I think, by the time I actually started karate. Um, I had a little bit of a break from it, you know, what, what things are like, uh, you know, got married, had kids, uh, got back into it again uh, later on, uh, did traditional taekwondo with uh, Matt Fidesz and then moved on to kickboxing with uh, KBF, Martial Arts Academy. Um, but All right. my whole life been watching the martial art films, you know, that was the love for me, watching martial art films, <laughs> later getting into Jackie Chan um, and then realising. So what I think 1996, I think it was the first Jackie Chan film I watched. And I watched that, and then I realized there was like a back catalog, like 20 year back catalog for me to catch up on. And I just could not believe it. My luck, all those Jackie Chan films to go back and rewatch. Yes, I know, right? It's like a, pl yeah. it's a plethora. It's a yes. plethora of goodness. But that is awesome, man. Thank, Thank you. you again for sharing your martial arts Thank background. You. I see there's awards on the wall there. That's right, representing. And since yeah. you're, uh, a big Van Damme fan. I want you to. I want you to rate Samurai Guy's moves here. All right, you know. <laughs> Just wait for you to do the splits and that. <laughs> Spot on. How was how was the moves? I, I, I know it wasn't Van Damme status. Was I was right. close? Really close. Right. That's spot on. Really good. <laughs> <laughs> just I was just waiting for a couple of guys to come up behind you, jump in the air, kick them in the head. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, we have fun here. Yeah. But thank you, Dan, for for showing up today. <laughs> okay. Let's let's go ahead and do the rock and roll. Mark, you missed you missed Samurai guys <laughs> Van Damme dancing. You missed Sorry, guys. it, man. You, yeah. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to go back. <laughs> uh but yeah let's keep going man let's keep it going i'm having a blast already all right let's go down to let's segue down to yeah ryan son ryan man so let's talk a little bit for those you know that are new that are watching you for the first time let's talk about uh your martial arts and stuntman background and how uh you got into films my friend so for me, uh, my martial art journey started quite late. I grew up watching a lot of action films. Um, for me, I, I mean, for me, like the earliest I remember is watching the Darth Maul fight with Ray Park. That's yeah. What I remember. I remember watching that and just thinking he looks so cool. I wonder how I can look that cool. And then I looked around. Um, I looked around and I ended up joining. Uh, my local karate club uh, in Kingsbridge. And then I started basically going to HMV and looking in the martial art and sort of action section and looking up all the different films that, you know, were available. And, you know, of course there was, uh, for me, I'd say like Jet Li's Unleashed was one of my absolute favorites. Um, yeah. There was a Turkish film as well called Fight. There was a Turkish one as well. I remember watching called Fighter it was really good. And then, I ended up picking up a very well-known British film called Underground, which I'm sure Mark knows all about. <laughs> and I remember watching that, and I was just absolutely blown away by all the people in it and how all these different styles, all these different performers, and seeing how they all came together. And then for me, I, when I was based in Scotland, I started, I found a stunt club called Storm Fight Club. 
they got me my first introduction to doing stunts and fight choreography. Right. And then when I came to, and then when I moved back to Devon, I kind of just kept it going. Really, I've trained with, I've trained with Mark. I've trained with other martial arts clubs, and I've just kept going and going. Mark teaches me online all the time. I'm always learning. I'm always pushing what I'm capable of, and. You know, for me, just this has been one long, fun journey, and I want to keep it going. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Awesome, awesome. And we will be watching your journey, my friend, and supporting you, my friend. Uh, but yeah, not just when well, not just it's not just the action and martial arts side of you and the stuntman side of you. Uh, shout out to you and Colin for both being in Rupture, by the way. That's awesome. <laughs> you guys are both in Rupture. Uh, getting killed by. Could, What's could up, I, Mark? Could I... Sorry to sorry to uh, butt in, my friend. Um, Go ahead. I've got something that I have to do that's just come up, and I really don't want to leave in the middle of it, okay. but I'm going to have to. Um, can I? Okay, um, no problem. Can I say a few words about the guys and the project now? I'm really sorry this has happened. Go for it. <laughs> Go ahead. Have fun. <laughs> yeah. No. Go ahead. Go ahead, Mark. I just want to. I just want to say what these guys did with this project. Yeah, I. I literally, I come up with the idea for the guys and rather than doing some screen fighting, we thought let's put a little concept together and make a uh, make a film, literally a fight film that I brought in Matt and to uh, direct and I just put the fights together for them and these guys did incredible. They had literally half a day, um, you know, to shoot the whole thing. Uh, plus they had like one day just put a block in and planning the fight. What these guys did was incredible for the, the amount of time that we had. It was phenomenal guys. And you all deserve a medal from my point of view. Oh, nice. Thank you, Mark. And there I'm excited well for said, everyone Mark. to see, the, see the, the clip as well, see the short film. Uh, and it deserves all the awards that it's won. Seriously, guys, you know, you worked so hard for me that day and, and it was a pleasure. Thank it was our pleasure as well. Nice. Mark, you guys go right now? About yeah, unfortunately. Right now? Yeah, so it's just something's cropped up and I've got it's it's on my mind and I can't I can't think of anything <laughs> to, to sort this problem out. <laughs> you still there, guys? We're still yeah, there, yeah. That's all right. Hey, thank you for all being right. here. Ultimate bro. apology. Sorry guys, I will uh I will I will speak to you all very soon. Okay, Mark. Talk to you soon. Mark. All right. No, no, it's all right, Mark. No problem. Sorry, guys. Bye. <laughs> Ooh, just the three of us now. Yeah. We can say what we like now. Thank you, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mark. All right. We had some cool. uh some some lag. Well, it's literally just the three of us. Okay. So. <laughs> yeah. hey, are we hosting this thing now? <laughs> <laughs> have we taken over the Fat Samurai's channel? Yeah. I think we yeah. have. Roll, roll VT. <laughs> we took over the film and now we're taking over this. It's all happening. <laughs> <laughs> Combat zone takeover. <laughs> wow. I think he's having trouble. Oh, there he is. Oh, yeah, he's he's back. There we go. There we go. Hey, we're professionals here. We keep it rocking and rolling. That's <laughs> it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Internet's unpredictable, man. You don't know what's <laughs> gonna happen, but we keep on going. We keep on going. Yeah. Uh, but it was great. That was that was very wonderful words, uh, Mark. I said about you guys, man. That's awesome. I mean, that's high praise, you know, coming from him mm -hmm. for you guys, you know. And I'm proud of I'm proud of you guys too. You know, and we're gonna we're gonna get to the fight. I was leading up to uh uh to the fight there. You know, samurai guy likes to build the the, yeah. the suspense before we get to the fight, uh, since we have a little bit of time here. Uh, going back to you, Ryan, uh, representing the horror side of things, uh, talk a little bit about your film, uh, The Winter Witch, here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, that was so. Um, I was actually really quite lucky. I last year I was working, uh, well, I was in Devon, and basically I got a message from a really nice actor, Jimmy the B. Bennett. Um, I've worked with him a couple of times. He put a cool word out to me saying, Listen, they're shooting a film not too far from you. They really need a fight coordinator, and you're the only person I know in Devon. Could you, could you do this? 
Yeah. I went along. Um, it's a film called Trafficking. It's actually premiering in Newcastle next month. Sadly, I can't go, but I know a lot of people who are going to that. But I was lucky enough to get onto that project choreographing. And then a few months later, the director, Richard Taylor, he messaged me and said, Ryan, I've got a very small part for you. It's a horror film. We're shooting in the same abandoned house, which Jimmy owns. Really good location if anyone does want to do it. And it was this detective, Detective Sleeman. And at the time, I had no idea what to expect. I did not really know that much about the horror film. But then after doing it, I was, it was just so much fun. Like being, just being this really not, it's weird because he is not, Detective Sleeman is not, I mean, he's a cop ultimately. He's not a terrible person, but I just remember playing that character. He's just, he's so sleazy and so disgusting. It's like just horrible, <laughs> the horrible, the way he's talking to this yeah, yeah. woman and this tragedy. And I, I had an absolute blast. And I remember, I remember not too long ago, um, you know, the first, I remember the first time I saw the DVD and it was, I was shopping in Asda. I look over and all of a sudden there's Winter Witch. And I'm just like, hang on, that's not, I turn it over and I see my name on the back and everyone, so many people have actually messaged me. I mean, heck, even my doctor knew about it. I, went, wow. I, I wound up in hospital not too long ago. I'm okay now, but I was talking to him. He was asking me about what I do. And I said, oh, I recently did Winter Witch. It's out soon. He's like, wait, the one on Amazon. Yeah, you what you've seen it like yeah, it's in my watch list and it's been so lovely the people who've messaged it and said I did a great job because you never know you do the best you can you hope people will like it but now I'm really I'm really happy I was honoured to do it and you know I only hope that these sorts of roles keep coming in you know it's been really yeah. good fun awesome awesome yeah representing the horror genre we love that here on the channel as well and and talking about you being the fire choreographer. Um, oh, that. you're also. Uh oh, we <laughs> oh, can skip past was... it. We don't have to talk about it. It's up to you. Oh, uh, no, 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 absolutely. I'll be more than I imagine. I'm gonna have a few people messaging me. Uh, in fact, two people I was I've literally come from set today with two people who I worked with on a new breed. It was so same people as Winter Witch and Trafficking. They okay. told me about this crime film they're doing in Newcastle. I got to go there for two weeks, meet so many cool people. There was there was all sorts, and I know that I'm probably not allowed to give too much away. Um, the premiere is not for a while. The film's not out till later this year, but it was it was a blast. There was so many different things the team asked me. There was everything from fist fights to you know sort of prison riots. There was there was shootouts. There was so many different things. Honestly, nice. I I people. There is going to be something for everyone, even if you're not a fan of crime films or gangster films. There is, there is something for everybody in a new breed of criminal. I really look forward to seeing what, what, it, what they do with it and where it's going. People wow, you got it. you got me sold on it now. I'm gonna have to put that on the list. <laughs> and last, before we get to Colin here, uh, talk a little bit about Immortum. Uh the thing I've literally finished from. So Immortum, it has mm. been. It has been a great work in progress. It started from being a feature film idea by Luke Abbott of King Collins. And it is just, it has evolved. It grew from being a feature film to a series. We've done public funding, private funding, and it's taking its time. But every single person I talk to about it is passionate. Everyone has said they love the storyline. They love the characters. We're doing we hope we're doing something fresh with the vampire genre. You know, it's been done so many times and so many yeah. great films out there, but I really feel like indie films, they do things, they do things different. They'll do where they can't do the big CGI fights. or they can't do these great character transformations that so many great films can do. We're doing things differently, but in a really good and fun way. And uh, I won't, again, I can't disclose too much yeah, yeah. today we were shooting we were actually shooting at Torquay Museum. We had an entire museum we were shooting in. People came from all over to be in it. And wow. We've got so many great things. I really can't wait to show what we've been up to with that. Nice. Yeah, we're going to have to get you back here on the channel when that when more gets, you know, revealed. But yeah, I mean, putting a new spin on the vampire genre, you know, Samurai guy's going to I'm going to be there to watch for sure <laughs> we got to represent here. All right, that's awesome, man. That's awesome. That is awesome. Awesome projects. Got to keep an eye out for. Now let's segue to Colin here. 
who's got an awesome, another awesome background there. Let's we, we, we got to <laughs> blow it up there. We got to blow it up there. Yeah, look at that. Got the Combat Zone poster back there. Okay. I see what, what what I see. JCVD. What is that on the right? Uh, that's a that's a new figure that's uh, come out a couple of months ago. Oh. I think. Oh like, man, yeah. I'm gonna have to uh look into that. That looks badass. Yeah. Is that Diamond Select? Is that a Diamond Select? Uh, yeah, I think, yeah, I think it is actually. Yes. Nice, yeah, it is. I'm, yeah, Diamond, yeah. Yeah. I'm seeing John Wick pop, Bruce Lee fig. No, yeah, that's actually, no, no, that one there that's a custom of Mark Strange in Rupture. That's a, oh. that's a, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's, that's, yeah, show, yeah, that's, oh, that's um, amazing! Oh, that is awesome. oh yeah, that's the, uh, amazing! I love that. The love um, <laughs> the guy I uh, the guy I do movie rankers with James. He um, he's into three D printing and and all that sort of stuff. And he's done uh, he's done a few customs and and things like that. It's uh, he's that pretty talented. A, that sort that's of stuff. amazing. That is amazing. <clears throat> well, shit, man. I mean, you got Bruce Lee fig, Van Dam fig, yeah. and a Mark Strange pop. We <laughs> are now brothers. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah man let, let's talk about um uh your martial arts background and uh what got you into combat zone what was what was the pitch you were like you know let's do this well oh, well i mean I, i'm the same as dan really i was about five when i watched kickboxer and that was that was me hooked it was always uh kind of like philip ree van damme Don yeah Dragon, and it was all the it was all the b movie sort of stuff that got me into it and then Later on, it was kind of like Drunken Master and and all the uh, Hong Kong legends and that sort of stuff that just got me hooked. And I didn't I didn't really start till later in life training martial arts, which was um, Taekwondo and kickboxing, which I started I started Taekwondo actually I don't know I, it was late teens probably under uh, my instructor Andrew Canard, and uh, then a later kickboxing went on with Ian Carter and and um, yeah I've pretty much been been doing it ever since really nice love it i love it and right above you it looks like you got the expendables 2 poster there yeah yeah i'll go to yeah that's yeah, the best that's, one in the trilogy yeah, side yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's the yeah. that's my favorite one that's yeah. awesome that's awesome yeah and and just like dan uh you're, you're making me jealous here you know <laughs> meeting all all these legends yeah that's right and yeah. uh especially scott i mean man that how cool was it to be scott times, yeah yeah, that, that's all through the Fighting Spirit Film Festival. That over over here, I mean, what they do is just, it gives action the chance to shine, really. They, they put the, the wing in, too. They, they put the festival on, I think it's about their eighth year now, and it just keeps nice. getting bigger and bigger. And it's kind of, I mean, I, I've, been, I've been going since it started, and uh, it, it just goes from strength to strength, really, there their festival and it's it's given a lot of people opportunities like Bo Fowler and all that sort of thing that he he it was all through that that he connected with Scott to get on Axe to Man 2 and you know Avengement and all that sort of thing it was um nice yeah it's quite good to have something like that to to go to that you know yeah that's nice I, I wish I could go but it's kind of far from me so. <laughs> yeah. but it's you know Samurai guy I'd be there it'd be worth a trip Oh Definitely. man, you tempt you tempted me. But you know, little shout out to the director of Combat Zone, Matt Rutledge. He couldn't make it yeah. tonight. Uh we'll no, get him he's, back he's, here. He's, yeah, he's filming. He's he's won a couple of awards there. I think yeah. he had the flicks are there and they they showed his feature film that he worked on and yeah. stuff yeah. like that. But he's he's been a supporter of the festival as well. So it's um you know, nice. it was it was it was quite nice for them to take the chance on Premiering Combat Zone, you know, with yeah. all the other shorts that they had. You know they, right. they they picked us and it was it was quite cool to be seen nice. on the big screen there sort of thing so yeah yeah we'll get matt here back on the channel in the future for sure but uh in terms of combat zone man yeah. uh what was it your were you were was it your idea that came up with it first or all of no, all of you no well basically what it was um we, i think we all started training with marks he put an ad out on uh yeah. over online over covid and he said, if people okay. want to train online, you know, let me know. And uh, all three of us started. And uh, once he saw what we could do, because I've had no film background, I don't think Dan has either. I, and I think... um, and he, he said, um, are you lot interested in putting something together? And we obviously all jumped to the chance. And yeah, that's he, he said he's got an idea. 
he pitched it to us and then we all kind of jumped at the opportunity to do it really oh that's nice awesome and then we showed yeah. up and then we showed up and all of a sudden it's like oh by the way guys we're using dumbbells <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, they kept okay. raising the stakes as we went along. <laughs> nice, nice. How how was how did the premiere go? What was that rupture? Oh, that that was nuts. Yeah, it was it was really good. Yeah, it was um, it was a good laugh. But, yeah, <laughs> it was busy as well. I mean, the, the, the cinema was packed. Yeah, sold out. Nice. I'm so glad you guys were there for the premiere of Rupture for yeah. sure. Yeah. But man, uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, this, were you involved with the little Q and A here, Colin? That was that was nuts. That was um, <laughs> yeah. That was pretty surreal. Who's Dude, up there with you? Uh, that's the art school dropouts. Uh, to be fair, not the others. I, I never really got anyone. It, it was all a blur. I, I, we literally uh, um, I landed, and then we had to we had to go straight there. Right, um, right, right. And uh, I had a couple of beers for some Dutch courage to get up there. And, <laughs> Lic liquid courage. Yeah, yeah, and. Uh, we we got in there and and the the theater was huge, and I, I didn't think we were going to win anything. And uh, I went and sat at the back, and James, who I went with, um, after our after our clip got shown, we got quite a decent reaction from a lot. Nice. Of, you know, we were in there with quite a few decent shorts, and we got quite a good reaction. And I looked down to text the guys, and it came up, and James James looked over me and said, "Your name's up there, mate." And I was right in the back of the cinema. And I didn't know that the filmmakers had to sit close to the front. So I had to right. walk all the way down. <laughs> and uh, I walked right up on stage. And Dimitri was like, where's your award? And I was like, what? And he goes, you're not going to be up here yet. You've got to collect your award. And I looked around. I mean, I, I, I felt like a right idiot up there. And I had, I, had, uh, I had Michael Joy White. I had Don the Dragon, Amy Johnston, Ron Van Cleef. Oh. They were all looking at me. And I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> I put my car and put my award up, and um, yeah, it was it was odd because obviously the art school dropouts they were up there, and I'm yeah I'm quite a fan of theirs, and uh, you know to, to be congratulated by everyone, like it was it was, it was surreal. That's a real moment. Yeah, that is amazing. I mean, uh, getting interviewed and and you know yeah. and just spreading the love. You know, you guys worked hard, and you guys deserve the accolades. You know for sure. So uh, more yeah. more more. more future projects for you guys you know let's get let's, let's get it out there man uh but okay. yeah let's go ahead and get to the the knit of the grit yeah. let's go ahead and show the fight everybody watching right now hey thanks again for turning tuning in live we're about to show the fight right now and in its entirety the short film fight combat zone and then afterwards we'll do a little uh reaction commentary style to it uh because i can't wait to ask these guys uh you know how they came across making this awesome little Fight short. All right, you guys ready? Here we go. Combat zone, baby. Let's do it. Welcome to Combat Zone. You have all been selected to fight to the death for your freedom. There are no rules. Just survive. Good luck.
congratulations. You have completed level one. Prepare for level two. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Real, Thank you. Thank you for showing that. Yeah. Thanks for that. Cheers. <laughs> the motherfucking action itch, baby. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I, I got it. I got it. I got to ask since I have you badasses here. All right. The Undertaker gag. Whose <laughs> idea was it for the Undertaker gag? Come on. Matt, was it? I think that, that was Matt's. Yeah. That was Matt? Oh, yeah, that was Matt's that idea. Was Matt. That yeah. is hilarious. Undertaker. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he was giggling while he was filming it. He was having yeah. the camera like right down on the floor, laying next to me, and I was giggling as I go to sit up. Yeah, you got the <laughs> chat here, saying, <laughs> Ethan. I need a membership at that jail. Uh, yeah, uh, proper KL working gym. <laughs> People were in yeah, there that while we were rehearsing. No way! Oh, that's hilarious. Yeah, that's, that's, yeah that's the first amazing. day we were in there putting it all together. We were walking around trying all these things out, and they were in there. Yeah. People were in there working out. We had a couple of people say to us, "You didn't realize this is a gym, didn't you?" And we were <laughs> like, "Yeah, that's right. We're not going to disturb you." <laughs> well, Kale uh, and Kevin enjoyed it. He really loved it there, and uh, of course, you know, Craig's given the 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 the, the, the claps there. Yeah. That's right. Craig enjoyed <laughs> hey, it. Craig. That's right. Uh, Ethan enjoyed it, and uh, Gilbert down here. He says that was great. Uh, no dialogue needed. Yeah, no dialogue <laughs> needed. That was that was amazing. That was amazing. Yeah, that was great stuff, guys. Great stuff. So let's have some more fun. Let's push it a little even further here, and let's uh, do it a little reaction commentary style here. So let me go ahead and bring it up. Bring us up here. We'll watch it again. Uh, it'll probably take a little bit of a while to get it going here. All right. Let's quite, see. It was quite fun because when we first got there, they were actually yeah. training tie, tie boxing in, in the ring. And then us three were just stood outside and like gently tapping each other. And they were all in there looking Play at fine, them, what, what the hell are they doing? <laughs> <laughs> they were actually in the ring just beating the crap out of each other. It was us three yeah. there. Yeah. Like, oh, no, yeah, no, yeah. Just got to miss me. And all that sort of thing. Or even oh. like people, people coming up to us and saying, Excuse me, are you actually using like those dumbbells and yeah. uh, those? This, this is just from rehearsal. Oh, no, no, you can have them. But, you know, we'll, we'll come back later. <laughs> oh, that's that is hilarious. <laughs> that's funny. All right, there we go. Now I got it rocking and rolling. Now let's do a little picture and picture action here. Get us in, in there and blow it up a little bit further. That's right. We got all the bells and whistles on here. All right, man. So let's. Yeah, really enjoyed that. That was a blast. And let's go ahead and uh, watch again here, and you guys can add your commentary. Yeah, yeah. Cool. How, uh, how long did it? And I was lagging a little bit when Mark was talking. How long did it? Um, uh, well, I mean, hold on a second. How long did it take? Uh, did Mark say it take to film all of this, Colin? Well, we we started rehearsing Saturday morning, and we had the day of rehearsal. Then we had a bit Sunday morning, and up. Well, yeah, we shot Sunday afternoon, wasn't it? Really. Yeah, oh, I think it was like four hours max. Yeah, it was about four hours filming. Yeah, it was. Fast. Oh wow, wow! And nice, just, nice. just we'd never done anything like this before either. So <laughs> you know, it was, this this was all new to us. We had to learn reactions. We had to learn where to hit and what works for the camera and that sort of I stuff. Am. Falls and all that sort of thing. So. Gotcha. Gotcha. Um, where where is this gym at? Well, whose gym is Preston. this? Smart Fit in Preston. It was yeah, Preston. Yeah, up north in England. Yeah, North UK. <laughs> yeah, this gym is pretty awesome for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah it really is. Yeah, it's a nice space. How many times did we do take standing up? I think it was like twelve attempts. <laughs> <laughs> Different angles, all the angles. <laughs> The thing is, when we filmed this bit, there are actually people behind. <laughs> yeah, look at look at. Yeah, yeah, there's still people in there, weren't they? Yeah, I think we might have done that bit at the end. We we're like, right, the gym's empty. Let's do that from the from a different angle at the end. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, I don't. Know, you guys did such a great film. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's just me getting up normally. You know, I struggle every day. <laughs> Samurai guy getting up, but yeah, Matt did a great job filming uh, the fight without showing anybody there. I mean, yeah. yeah, very, very great job there. But yeah, this gym's pretty badass. 
But yeah, let's keep it going here. Yeah, what fun. Oh, there you go. Dan with the Van Dam there. Yeah. See that? <laughs> Got the Van Dam on the oh, sweatshirt there. there. Where'd you get that sweatshirt? That's off one of his one of his websites. <laughs> An official. Nice. Official yeah, merchandise. Nice. And Colin, wasn't it you wearing the Aggie Doe t shirt? Yeah, yeah. Just in so, uh, you got a little Hitman 47 vibe there, uh, Ryan. Well, yeah. well, Mark said, you know, can you all bring costumes with you? And it's like, he said, you know, if any of you got like suits or anything like that, bring that with you. I show up and it's like, <laughs> they're all in their jeans and t-shirts. I'm the only one wearing a suit. And it's like, by default, I'm going to have to fight in this, aren't I? Yeah, you are. <laughs> right. Well, no, it worked. Oh, man, it was, that's funny. It worked really well. Yeah. <laughs> Nice. We needed nice. to look different, didn't we? You know, yeah, that was yeah. The idea. yeah. It actually it we were, worked out we were better. Just that off way. the street and fight. Yeah, it worked out better. You guys are all have your own personalities and yeah, and different. But yeah, great camera angles. Matt knows what he's doing. When he oh, when he started up, serious. Wait, hold on, hold on. Wait, <laughs> wait a minute. What is <laughs> wait a minute? Am I, is that Miyagi Do shirt there, Colin? Yeah, 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 yeah. It was either that or Cobra Kai, but I was in a good mood. (laughs) T-shirt saying, you're in a good mood. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, 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 exactly, yeah. That's awesome. When Matt showed up and Mark done the run-through with it, he was like, I don't think we're going to get this shot. And uh, he he was quite shocked with what we'd done um, on the Saturday, and he didn't didn't think we were going to get it all finished just in in the hours that we had. Yeah. Nice. Dan's character. <laughs> like immediately, <laughs> you two just like, yeah, you know, let's team up on this guy. Like immediately. Yeah. Like, poor Dan, you know. Yeah. I'm like, no, no. I feel oh, bit drunk. Look Ooh, nice one, Ryan. <laughs> You're like, well, we got to fight each other now. Boom. <laughs> no close calls or injuries? Uh, um, oh. Uh, <laughs> I can't, I can't, I'm trying to remember now, but I what was it? I swear there was one point you did that kick and you just fell out. You fell straight over. You like missed the no, man. That was, that was when I done the uh, sidekick into you a bit later. I think that's when I done my knee in, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ah, that's to come. Um. Well, let's let let's uh. Colin here showing off. What? <laughs> what? And Mark, what off. was Mark? What was Mark's? What was it? Was Mark kept shouting? Yeah, like, you do it. I see a <laughs> <laughs> Dan was doing a Dan, you're doing a lot of lot of lot of knees. A lot of knee attacks. Yeah. Yeah, I kept getting thrown down a lot as well. Straight away. I'm getting thrown down. Yeah, and hold on. Okay. Knee, kick, punch, 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 kick, kick. Nice. I like that little series of come. There, that was good. Ryan's having yep. Ryan's having mercy. Are you having mercy, Ryan? <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> right, right here. <laughs> uh, Ryan's face, right here. Here we go. Look, I, Ryan. I don't know, brother. I think you enjoy playing bad guys. <laughs> well, I keep adding cost in them. I think you so enjoy villains, enjoy man. It. Hey, it's... <laughs> yeah. Well, I, I heard it's always fun to play bad guys. Anyway, you know, I heard, I heard it's always more fun to play villain. Uh, but yeah, he's like, you know what? I'm not going to punch him. I'm going to let uh, Colin get the hit. Here. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> that man, like, uh, nope. <laughs> I love Doesn't that. Last long. Let me go back. <laughs> Yeah. I get him back. Handshake. Good job. Good job. Good job. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> it steps up. 
Like we're 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 we're, tur- we're turning it up to eleven now. We gotta get we gotta get the weights. I love how, now using using what's around you. Was that Jackie Chan inspired? I I don't know. I, thought, I think Mark just kind of saw it all there, and he was like, "Well, let's just start using this stuff." Then it, nothing nothing was really planned. It was just like, "Well, let's no. just start throwing all this in." Yeah. We were just no, warming up at the time when Mark said to us, I'll start warming up and stretching. And then we could see him just walking around the gym, picking up bits of equipment and swinging <laughs> it around, <laughs> seeing what he could do with it. <laughs> well, I like yeah. that. The fight escalates, you know, it gets more intense. And then it turns into oh! a fight and sink. <laughs> Go back. That was a nice, that was a nice punch. Yeah. Bam! Look at that. It's just fun now. We're just we're just having a blast yeah. now. We're just using everything around us and having a having a yeah. nice time. Undertaker spot. Undertaker spot. <laughs> Love it. He's back. Shout out to Matt. <laughs> Colin's like, come on, man. <laughs> what is going on? Nice. Oh wait, he's back. I'm Mark's back. I've back. got half an hour, guys. I've got half no, an hour. No. I'm very uh, sorry for leaving. <laughs> Welcome oh, back. no, no, it's okay. We're, we're getting close to wrapping it up anyway. No, Mark, no, I'm really, really apologize. I've just got some family issues. So, uh, but I've got oh, half no, an hour. I've no got half an hour, guys. So if there's That's any good. questions. Okay, okay. Go for it. Okay. Yeah, so now we're doing a, we're doing it. We're showing it. We already showed the fight in its entirety, Mark. And now we're watching it again for fun. And you guys add your commentary again, the behind the scenes. Uh, making awesome. them. So they just <laughs> remember how uh, you came up with the idea uh, you came up with the idea with them to start using uh, things around the gym. Yeah, for sure. But well, we wanted to make it as fun as possible with the choreography. Um, and, see. you know, we're in a gym, so why not use what's around the surroundings, you know? And it was kind of like a bit of an homage yeah. to uh, China O'Brien. Remember China O'Brien? Oh, yeah. yeah. Cynthia yeah. Rock Rock, yeah. Where she's, like, using the weights and the other fight. Oh, yeah, and- yeah. Yeah, we kind of did an up- upgrade version, um, <laughs> 2022 version. <laughs> yeah, love it. I love it. Sure. I think it was. And we just talking about how the fight just gets more intense. Colin's like, "What do I have to do to keep these guys <laughs> down here?" <laughs> Yeah, did, did did you like uh, did you like Daniel's um, kind of raise <laughs> like Undertaker? Yeah. <laughs> yes, yeah, I that was yes, Matt's idea. Yes, was. I, I had to ask whose idea was that. It was Matt's idea, yeah. Now, yeah. now, Dan, now, Dan, this was payback for what Ryan and this was yeah. payback right here. Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> payback on Ryan right to the face. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> down, down. Catch a break. Right. <laughs> See more knees, Dan. I love loving, loving, loving that Muay Thai kick kickboxer stuff. Grounded, yeah. grounded pound now. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Look at that. Get that bob out there. Look at the chains, man. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at right there, Ryan showing off now. Look at that. I gotta, I gotta go back. Yeah. Look at Ryan showing off. I saw that, Ryan. Here it comes. Here it comes. Oh, what? I, I don't know who's, I don't know who's got it, but there is someone who's got PTSD <laughs> oh, doing that, that jump kick, and my foot landing in a bin. Was, yeah. Oh yeah! <laughs> Someone's got that video somewhere. It's just like, yeah. yes, it looks so cool. And then there's just people over into a bin. And then, yeah, then... Oh, sidekick, playing sidekick. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that samurai go. Samurai guy knows where to pause the shit. You know, yeah, ball, <laughs> bad, <laughs> badass right there, Colin. Showing off, baby. Oh, that's, <laughs> that's right. That's right. Was that bit? I thought I actually hit you there. I think Ryan did. Oh, this is this is where I done my knee. You guys are tired, yeah. beat up. <laughs> it was a very long day. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Um, the sun, well, every, everything just kind of crammed into the hours that we'd done when we were filming it. You know, it was, 
Oh, it's phenomenal. Sure, you know, you know the, the, the idea, you know, like putting it together was all I thought was just three guys kind of have been drugged. They wake up in a facility and they've just, been, you know, they've got to fight to the death. It's like, what? I love it how they don't try and find any way to escape. <laughs> <laughs> Straight into fighting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you told us to. <laughs> yeah, I know. This is great. Yeah, this is yeah. this is what we wanted, you know. And um, then, oh, you know, I mentioned, obviously, uh, China or Brian with the weights and stuff. Um, the other kind of idea that I put together with them being free of them, I don't know if you've, uh, I'm sure some of you guys have seen it, um, is Dragons Forever, where they all have a bit mm. of a fight. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, Jackie. Good. Yeah, I kind of, I, I kind of took some, influence from that as well in the sense of keeping it frantic and one gets hit the other gets hit the other moves you know and just literally creating something uh you know exciting you know because it's, it's quite difficult you've got three people fighting it's it's right. trying to put layers in there and and create it but matt did a fantastic job of the edit and mm. shoot, shooting the scene as well it's um yeah he did great was the, the polish up after and that wasn't it? He said that you know once once we'd done it, he said, "Oh, actually, I'll just add a bit more to the sound yeah. and that sort of thing." And it just that's you know it was for that that we we got it entered into some of the stuff after Matt done the editing as well. It was um and sound. Yeah, and he brought he brought a great sound team in as well. Uh, yeah, studio team didn't he? So which was give yeah. it a nice feel with the with with the crunches and the bone hitting strikes. Oh yeah. Sound yeah, design yeah. is great. Sound design yeah. is so important. The more yeah. especially recently the more I watch movies, sound is really important. And and you, and, and you guys nailed it with this move uh, with this film here. Like it's you feel the crunches. You go, "Oh, <laughs> like you know that had to hurt." Yeah. Right? Yeah. But uh yeah. yeah. Dumbbell fighting, let's go. I love the 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 look here. Like <laughs> <laughs> that's, 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 that's Daniel's uh, right. I'm Size gonna, I'm Size gonna see you guys in. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. that, that was such a great react. That's a great shot, no, number one, from Matt here. Great yeah. shot, and then we have the reverse shot. Of Dan. <laughs> Dan. I thought oh, I was I gonna have the upper hand, man. it didn't last long. Boom, 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 <laughs> boom. Let's go. Boom. Oh, boom. Oh. Uh, oh, oh, right there to the knee. That, that, all. Oh. oh, you took a little bump there, Dan. Yeah. A little, little bump right there. Boom. Look at that. Straight out of it. Yep. <laughs> uh, Colin's up. Colin's upgrading. Colin's upgrading now. <laughs> See if he can do better with uh, it than I did. Mm, and the ribs. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Oh. That, that, oh, selling, Ryan. <laughs> great selling ryan I, this this one right here boom that to the knee man that i felt that That's gonna hurt. i felt yeah. that this one right yeah. here <laughs> yeah when we were rehearsing um, ryan just looked at me and the said way ryan don't, sells the head there look at that look at you ryan <laughs> uh, i've got no honestly i've got to thank mark for that landing i remember 20 attempts on Saturday and I was like I was not getting it and then Sunday he was just like right breathe and this is what you do and we're going to get it and literally first take yeah. I managed to finally land do that landing it was so difficult but Mark he made it sound so easy I made it look easy as well nice, nice. but no I it's Mark practice that. my friend I know many, many I know I know <laughs> I remember watching this for the very first time and I was already enjoying the fight. And then when, when we go to level two here and then it <laughs> zooms in on Mark, I was like, Oh shit. Yeah. I was like, Oh shit. Well, poor, Col poor, we, poor Colin, man. Yeah. Poor Colin. Well, was, yeah. Cause on Saturday, Mark was telling us, you know, he'll, I'm going to voice you guys. I'm going to lead you in. And then there'll be like a level two or something. And, you know, Mark was wearing his gear. He just done a workout. And he was like, you know, it'd be terrifying, Mark, if the camera panned over from Colin and you were there. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And that, and, yeah. You know, there's my there's Beautiful. my little cameo for you guys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and now oh, everyone's asking us, you yeah. know, so are we going to see a second one and Mark kicks the crap out of all you three? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In my mind, I've already I've already got yeah. combat uh, combat zone two planned. 
um, where you guys will fight. The level two is weapons. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, (laughs) nice. Nice. That is a part exclusive right here on the channel. Uh, (laughs) But yeah, Mark, is that so? It is a it is a, a good possibility. We will get another one. You never can tell. You never can tell. I know the guys will probably want nice. to do something. We're all game, yeah. I'm, yeah I'm so they're all game. So maybe, maybe we'll work something out. Uh, maybe later this year. Ooh, yeah, 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 for yeah. sure. Yeah, yeah. And, I mean, and yeah. then every combat zone after that will just get more intense and more crazier. <laughs> you know, <laughs> <laughs> and it'll be like it'll be like combat zone twenty five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it'll be it'll be good. It'll yeah, be it'll be kind of stuck in like some nightmare dream sequence. <laughs> <laughs> it'll be all gun fu by that time. You guys will all have pistols. It'll be a gun fu fight, uh, all three of you. But yeah, that was amazing. Hey, ho, I enjoyed it. Thank you. Uh, thanks, thanks, Mark, thank you for popping much. back in to give us hey, a little no bit problem. more commentary. No problem at all, guys. Yeah, man. And uh, this was a lot of fun. This was a blast. I'm definitely looking forward to more comp. I'm, I'm looking forward to Combat Zone 50. All right. <laughs> let's, let's, let's do get this. Get a bigger budget. Get Van Damme in it. Yeah. yeah <laughs> there you go. There you go. I was actually thinking more, more that you'll have a, you have to fight a hundred uh, kind of people in the facility. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 It's like a free for like that. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, free for all or or a hundred ninjas. I mean, you could do the sky's the limit. You could do anything. Yeah. You could do anything. Oh, uh, but cool. this is this is what it's all about right here. Yeah. Is uh, dedication, hard work, and uh, all you guys yeah, coming cool. together, working hard to give us something fun. And uh, again, me, Samurai Guy, and Movie Dojo Army, uh, we support any future right. endeavors uh, from all of you. And uh, I'm sure Dan, I'm sure you've gotten the bug. I'm Colin, I'm sure you've gotten oh, the yeah. bug even more yeah. to do more film yeah. projects. And uh Mark, I, I know I know you hinted that something's even more amazingly awesome coming in the future, but I gotta plug what's coming soon. So don't forget, guys, you can catch rupture uh on Tubi right now, but keep an eye out for Hounds of War Thanks, and brother. dig me, mm-hmm. dig me no grave. Uh yes. Mark Strange projects. Keep an eye out for that coming very soon. Thank and uh, this was this was a blast. This was a blast, my friend. That's Thank right. You. Thank, you. Thank you for having us. Yes, yes. And Dan, Ryan, Mark, you already know this, but Dan, Ryan, and Colin, hey, like we tell all our guests, this is now your second home, my friend. You guys oh, are welcome you. back okay. anytime. Do movie reviews, <laughs> talk about your future projects, anything. We'll have some fun here. Uh, we'll go ahead and end it for today. Thanks, all of you badasses, yeah, for watching. Much. Don't forget, if you're Thanks, new here, guys. Don't to- great work, everybody. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Don't Just forget to like, up. share, and subscribe to the old samurai guy. And everyone's information uh, is in the description box below, guys. So you can follow Dan, Colin, Ryan, and Mark's uh, future badassity endeavors. That's right. So make sure <laughs> you follow up. them. Keep an eye out for Combat Zone 50. <laughs> and uh, we'll see you guys on the next one. You guys don't go anywhere, but you guys watching, we'll see you on the next one. Take care. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.